that, let's get you some ideas of profit coming in from our colleagues at Money Control Pro. And today we have Anubhav Sahu joining in with the stock that he's been tracking. We are looking at Zydus Life Sciences, uh, which posted a strong performance in Q4, uh, driven by international markets. Uh, since our echo, uh, six months back, uh, the stock has nearly doubled. Uh, while we are aware of these transitional opportunity due to rev limit, uh, we believe there is a merit in tracking the underlying businesses in the US and in India. Uh, follow what adds to the growth optionality is the progress in new chemical entities. Uh, it is noteworthy that with respect to Snowflast, a uh, company has received US FDA approval uh, to initiate phase two clinical trials uh, for Parkinson's disease. Uh, coming to fiscal 25, uh, US market is expected to witness growth in high teens, uh, backed by traction for transdermals, peptides, and niche products like Mira Background. Uh, domestic formulation is also expected to do well on the back of nephrology, uh, oncology, and derma. Uh, biosimilars should also scale up from the current portfolio of 30 products. Uh, that said, growth in the consumer healthcare segment uh, can be a key differentiator, uh, which is also a function of rural recovery. Now, with respect to margins, we expect some moderation uh, over the medium term uh, as the gains from rev limit wanes. While the stock is not inexpensive, uh, a business on the pharma innovation side can help it for the rate.